What's going on everybody? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to the channel. I love getting information on impending video game console releases. I'm sure you guys do too. And uh, whenever there's a new tidbit of information about a potential console coming out, I always like to be one of the first people to get it. And it doesn't always come from a certified source. A lot of times online retail outlets and distributors will accidentally leak information perfect example would be one of the many times that Amazon has accidentally leaked an upcoming video game and quickly taken it off the website, giving people a pretty good idea as to what they can expect, how much it'll be, and, and etc. Now, with the PlayStation 4K, there's been an apparent leak of information that may uh, allude to the actual release date of the PlayStation 4K. For people who don't know, the PlayStation 4K is Sony's new PlayStation 4 with an improved GPU and uh, probably more than likely a slimmer form factor, uh, also making it a PlayStation 4 slim. I'll drop a link in the description. Distributor accidentally leaks release date for the PlayStation 4K or Neo. Sony is almost certainly working on the 2016 release of a new PlayStation with 4K capability, which can be sort of considered a PlayStation 4.5 or a PlayStation 4K or the PlayStation Neo depending on which specific name rumors you believe. Well aside from assorted speculative details on the specs of this almost certainly upcoming new PlayStation platform, we've also now apparently got a concrete release date leak from one of Sony's distribution partners. According to the latest, the website VideoGamer.com shared information out of a press release from the consumer technology distributor Intellect Multimedia, in which confidential information about the release of the PlayStation 4K may have accidentally been included. According to the French website, the PlayStation 4K, or Neo apparently what it's being called by insiders at Sony, will be unveiled officially to the consumer public sometime between April and September of 2016. That information is still a bit vague, and even if it's confidential information leak, we can already rule out April as a possible release date, seeing as how it's behind us, but this still leaves the possibility that the release leak is indeed real and will apply over the next four and a half months left according to the range of possible months mentioned. So we're left looking at a possible May, June, July, August, or September release date. And if the leak is true, that means that the PlayStation 4K or PlayStation 4.5 will be hitting the shelves before PlayStation VR, which Sony has already officially confirmed for an October 2016 release. What if any direct connection to PSVR and the PlayStation 4.5 will have is still unknown, other than the obvious fact that they both serve the same Sony consumer gaming market? Now that these rumors have slipped out from the supposed intellect press release leak, the distribution company has of course gone on the counter-offensive, releasing a formal statement in which, quote, Intellect denies any official information about the launch of the PlayStation 4K or PlayStation Neo. It is possible that during 2016 or 2017 physical developments exist on the current PlayStation 4, but for the moment we have no information about the nature of them." End quote. This more formal statement from Intellect Multimedia may indeed be true, but many tech watchers seem to be unconvinced and consider their latter statement to be a cover-up by the company over an accidental slip of real PlayStation 4K release information. So far, among the possible target dates for the release of the 4K PlayStation console, the most likely possible candidate is June, since this is when the Electronic Entertainment Expo kicks off, and it's at this event that Sony looks like it's most likely to spring something like the PlayStation 4K or Neo for a subsequent shipping start date sometime between July and September. Games that have also been optimized for the PlayStation 4K would also likely emerge in those two months if all the above pans out. As we've covered previously, the PlayStation 4K is expected to come with greatly enhanced CPU, GPU, clock speed, along with higher memory bandwidth, and will include support for 4K resolution, at least to some degree. The most reputable current rumors about the platform also indicate support for 4K Blu-ray disc media, making the console into a sort of hybrid gaming console and Sony 4K Blu-ray disc player. This uh, sounds pretty reasonable, guys. We know they're gearing up for this thing. It's going to be this year. Uh, we know in October PlayStation VR is going to be out, uh, and it has to be before then. I know we're going to have uh, the reveal at E3. That's definitely going to happen, and uh, I'm looking forward to it. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. Does this leak sound reasonable to you guys? We're looking at four, four and a half months until the end period for this article. I think that this distributor actually did leak it. Their, uh, their quote sounds extremely defensive. Uh, and uh, I think that more than likely one of their PR guys had to get out there and basically uh, put out the fire before it burned the house down. We're going to have PlayStation 4K real soon, and I'm looking forward to it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give a thumbs up. Show support for the channel. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe now. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.